S'mores rolls and strawberry shortcakes. Guys, it's not Little Debbie because you're in Canada. This is Vachon country. Hello, food freaks, and welcome to That's Rank. Down south, the snack cake industry is held down by powerhouses Hostess, Little Debbie, and Mrs. Freshly's, but up here, Vachon has been making hay since 1923. Joe Louis, Mae West, Passion Flakies, Ah Caramels, and so many more staples in every child's lunchboxes. And comparative to their American counterparts, frankly, they're better. Seriously, if you've never pressed your flavor flicker into a Joe Louis, you have not lived, my friend. These guys know snack cakes better than I know my own son. And speaking of my son, part of the reason I'm actually filming this today is because he's asked me every single day since I bought these if he can have them. No matter whether or not I actually like them as irrelevant, he's decided that he's gonna be a massive fan. And you know what? I'm gonna start off with the strawberry shortcake ones today. These are the ones that are personally calling to me the most, which is probably a mistake since I hate fake strawberry flavor. But this is Vachon that we're talking about. You know, Vachon is a proud company. Vachon is the kind of company that wouldn't let me down with fake flavor now, would they? I don't actually know if they would. These packages only sell for a couple of bucks, so maybe I shouldn't get my hopes up too high. Okay, it comes in one giant log. I wasn't expecting that. I'm gonna need a knife. Hang on. You have probably gathered by now that these are basically like Swiss rolls or ho-hos, but of course you'd be wrong to think that. Come on, these aren't Swiss, they're French. Take a look at this and I can just feel how spongy it is. It's really, really soft, really moist. You know what, let's, uh, let's take a look at the calorie count on this thing because this looks and feels like it's aiming to hurt me. Okay, so we've got 280 calories with 35 grams of sugar per slice of these things. And somehow that's still better than I was expecting. This is almost a health food. You could probably subside on this entire log. Uh, your blood sugar is gonna be a disaster, but you still might lose weight. Hmm. Jackpot. What they were so smart to do here was use a filling that's a lot closer to a strawberry jam as opposed to trying to get cute with this stuff. The cream, of course, the same cream that you're gonna find inside a Passion Flakey or a Joe Louis, which really is everything that I ever wanted in here. Without being too hyperbolic, this is a fantastic little grab and go option if you're looking for something to take to a picnic or maybe while you're out camping. You know, this is a really great option. It's got about a month of being shelf stable and it's not fancy eating by any stretch. Look, if you want strawberry shortcake, hell, you do you. Strawberry shortcake is amazing, but as a cheap dessert to go, like this is really good. How would I describe it? Um, I think I'm still banned from using the word moist. Maybe it's dampish or clammy, sweaty. You know, pick whichever one of those sounds best to you. I'm gonna go with clammy. All right, s'mores, y'all have some serious work to do in today's competition. So the s'mores, is still a rolled cake, much like the uh, strawberry shortcake. So I'm expecting much of the same degree of uh, uh, dewiness uh, in the cake itself. Really for me though, the wild card is just how well they get the cake to get the graham cracker taste in there. So taking a look at both the picture on the box and the cake itself, I don't really see any indication of graham crackers, which would make it not a s'more. What I'm hoping for is a crunchy surprise in the middle of this. Uh, one of the only times, and I mean ever, that you should be wishing for a crunchy surprise. No crunchy surprise, guys. Damn. My feeling is what they were going for was the cake is the graham cracker, but this cake has less Grammys than Diana Ross's career. True fact, she never won one. Look it up. In fact, this cake is as much s'mores as Diana Ross is. Let's just unroll this thing here. Take a look. So the cream in here is marshmallow flavored, but it's not as sticky as a marshmallow is. The chocolate itself is fine. It's a good chocolate cream roll up. And in fact, I'd even go so far as to say that I personally recommend it. It's a stunning treat like Miss Diana Ross. In fact, I'd even call this supreme. But let's talk about what it's not, and that's a s'more. The marshmallows, not toasty. The cake isn't graham crackery, and the chocolate, uh, well, well, the chocolate is melty, so at least they got that right. I'm not gonna hate on that. So of the two of these, I do recommend trying both of them, but if you only have budgetary room for one box of Vachon snack cakes in your cart this week, uh, make it a Joe Louis. Joe Louis's the greatest, there really is no topping a Joe Louis. Now between the two of these, I'd say that I preferred the strawberry shortcake. 
I don't personally foresee ever buying either of these again. I think they're only here for a limited time. And by the time that I get through these snack cakes and get a hankering for another box, that window will have almost certainly expired. But if they were around, I could see getting another one someday. All right, my friends, do you have a snack cake that you simply can't say no to? Comment below and please do not forget to hit the subscribe button because reviewing these things is sort of what I do. Join me next time. You never know what sort of crunchy surprises that I might bite into next.